I added some new sounds to my soundboard, okay? So this is probably one of the more famous ones. I'm dumber than a box of rocks in a lot of areas. Facebook just makes people think I'm smart. That's Greg Locke. Um, and he, you know, I don't like to insult people. That's, like, not my thing at all. I don't like doing it. Lowbrow, and, uh, you know, I'm in a position of influence, and I just don't think it's right to insult people, really, in all, in all seriousness. So I let Greg do it for me. And I also let Shane Vaughn do it for me. I've lived for the Lord my whole life, and I was dumb as a box of rocks and didn't know it. I have a couple of others, but and they're a little bit longer, so let me play the brand new ones that I just added, okay? And th there's a reason I've been stalling and playing them last, and it's because they have swears in them. And if I put swears at the beginning of a video, then YouTube, you know, they, they're not a fan of that, so... I feel now I'm pretty I'm pretty comfortable playing it. So check this out. No. We'll do it live. Quack. Do it live. I can. I'll write it and we'll do it live. I got that one. <laughs> Took me ten minutes to add these. And here's another one. Quack. Thing sucks. I love it to death, dude. If if we could cover just that video every day, I would be so happy. But we can't. Because, you know, you can only cover the same thing so many times. So if you're if you're unaware of it, if you never heard of it or whatever, it's a famous meme at this point. And it, it's like it's Bill O'Reilly. He was on Inside Edition. He was the the anchor there. It's before he was a right wing nutcase, uh, extremist, stochastic terrorist. He was viewed more moderately. Basically, the, I guess they do some taping ahead of time and put it on air, and it's kind of a hybrid thing. Some of it is live, some of it's not. And the part where Bill O'Reilly, like, ends the show and gives it off to, like, Sting, the band Sting, I guess that's that's where Bill O'Reilly kind of got hung up with the teleprompter. Just, just listen for a second here. That's tomorrow, and that is it for us today. Okay, I don't know what... It, whatever it is, it's not right on a teleprompter. I don't know what that is. I've never seen that. No, there it is. We are going to do it. says something to the effect of, to play us out, we're going to have a clip from Sting off his new album. Something to that effect. Now, being in the industry for so long, I mean, this dude was like, he's been a reporter for like, I don't know, 10, 15, 20 years at this point, maybe. I don't know. Long, long, long time on the ground and then moved into the anchor position and, and did deep dives and everything. Had he never heard the, the term pl to play us out before? Th this is really the first time he's ever heard that term? Sting, yeah. Okay, but... And he, his complaint here is that the teleprompter says, to play us out, here's a clip of Sting, or cut off his new album or whatever. And he doesn't know what it means. No, there it is. We are going to do Sting, yeah. Okay, but... Okay. Now, yeah, I can't read it. There's no, there's no words on it. Okay. Any? Sure. There's yeah. no words there to play us out. Oh, oh, there are words there, as it turns out. They're just words that you don't, you, for some reason, uh, insist on pretending you've never heard before. Such a douchebag, dude, really. How is somebody this much of a douchebag? Quick note before we continue, I want to let you know I just wrote a book. If you want to check it out, owenmorgan.com slash book. It's a book about my experiences within Jehovah's Witnesses. It's completely understandable if you know nothing about Jehovah's Witnesses. And if you're a Christian, it's a good reference to use for why Jehovah's Witnesses are wrong about their interpretation of the Bible. The last chapter of the book is 100 questions that I have for the governing body. I'm selling the last chapter separately as its own separate guide if you guys want to get that too. So check it out, owenmorgan.com slash book. I'd appreciate that. Any? Sure. There's no words there to play us out. What does that mean, to play us out? The f*** do you think that means, Bill? Really? You don't know what to play us out means? A reporter for 10, 15 years and all that sh News anchor and everything. And your experience has not granted you the knowledge yet to understand the term to play us out? Are you f***ing kidding me? It's, it's Sting is going to do... It's a video. Sting video. 
What is for credits? I don't know what that means to play us out. What does that mean? To end the show? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. He did it all by himself. He figured it out. Nobody had to contribute or explain. He just figured it out. You know, he sat there screaming at people for 41 seconds about how he didn't know what it meant. And that's all it took. You know, it just took him 41 seconds of screaming to get it. That That's all it took. Now he gets, oh, to, to end the show. Okay, that's what it means. I'm sorry. No, that's the thing. He doesn't offer an apology to these people. Video. Okay. What is for credits? I don't know what that means to play us out. What does that mean? To end the show? Yeah. Like he knew the whole time. Obviously, he just wanted to be a head, right? Yeah. All right, go, go. In five, four, three. That's tomorrow, and that is it. Okay. In. Five. Dude, I've been there. I've been there. I just recorded my audiobook for, God, dude, 30 hours I recorded, but it's ultimately going to be like way shorter, like 10, 12 hours maybe of audiobook, but 30 hours of footage. And that's just the <laughs> that I kept so that I can, because I repeated the same thing over and over again to get the correct tonality and everything, you know, and I'm going to have to edit that about three times as long as to edit as footage I have. So every hour of footage I have, it takes three hours to edit. 30 hours of footage, it's going to take me 90 hours to edit that. And I already have a full plate, so I'm going to, like, God, the audiobooks, you know what? I, I'm going to burn through that though, man. I'm going to do everything I can to have that done next week, maybe. We'll see. It just depends. I mean, I'm already way behind on like way behind from recording, spending 30 hours or 40 hours recording. That, that set me way behind. But, you know, the point is I've been there. Sometimes you got to get the tone right. That's okay. Just do a retake. No big deal. It can be frustrating. That's fine. Do a retake. That's tomorrow, and that is it. Okay. Yeah. Uh, but you have to acknowledge it's on you. Five, four, three. That's tomorrow, and that is it for us today. And we will leave you with a... I, I can't do it. Okay. We'll do it live. Okay. We'll, no. we'll do it live. Quack it. Do it live. I can, I'll write it and we'll do it live. Dude, I love it. No. We'll do it live. Quack it. Do it live. I can, I'll write it and we'll do it live. I love everything about it. It's so fantastic. He's so angry. And I've said this because I've talked about this clip like multiple times now, but it really brings me joy to, to watch. <laughs> but, uh... <laughs> What really gets me, like, when I watch this clip is watching his little hair floof in the front go up and down, and he says he's yelling and getting angry. Okay. We'll do it live. Okay. We'll, no. we'll do it. Now, watch, watch the hair floof. He's about to do the, you know, fuck it. He's about to do that. Watch the hair floof. Do it. Okay. We'll do it live. Okay. We'll, no. we'll do it live. Fuck it. Do you see the hair floof go pull? <laughs> I love it, dude. Do it live. I can, I'll write it and we'll do it live. No. We'll do it live. <laughs> I love it to death. Fucking <laughs> thing sucks. And that's where, my, that's where my other soundboard sound came from. Fucking <laughs> thing sucks. Oh my God. I love it to death. I swear, like, I could be in the deepest, like, darkest state of depression. You know, lost my dog and my, I don't even have a dog, lost my dog and my kid and my truck and, I, you know, lost my beer and my everything. Whatever country singers complain about losing, I could lose all of that shit. And I could hear Bill O'Reilly yelling, and thing sucks. And it would bring joy to my heart for real. Oh, I love it. Okay, keep listening. Write it and we'll do it live. And thing sucks. Yeah. <laughs> The hair floof again. <laughs> Five, four, three. That's tomorrow, and that is it for us today. I'm Bill O'Reilly. Thanks again for watching. We'll leave you with Sting and a cut off his new album. Take it away. Wow, check that out. He did it all by himself. That's really impressive. Oh, it's not over, though. He, you know, there's more for it. He throws his pen, rips his jacket off. I don't know what was what, what I don't know what he did next. He did something, grabbed something, but oh my god.
anger issues much chill out bro it's not that big of a deal you have any idea how many times i repeated the same sentence for my book when i was recording a lot five or six sometimes sometimes you gotta get it just right that's okay sometimes it's frustrating that's okay too but harassing and mistreating people around you and throwing shit and saying and thing sucks and we'll do it live do it live and and then just like and obstinately refusing to understand something that is common knowledge certainly in the news industry like you can't do that shit, man don't be like don't be like don't be a bill o'reilly okay and he throws his pen rips that jacket off so angry oh man that's not the only you know okay we're not here to talk about bill o'reilly i could go down a whole bill o'reilly rabbit hole but we're not here to do that today Ugh, i just love that clip to death man